Hey, my water signs is sunny, and this is your weekend insert for the days of June 19th, June 20th, and June 21st. I don't know why I said June three times. I doubt. But anywho, um, well, Cancers, you are celebrating your birthday this weekend, so happy birthday. Maybe that's why I kept saying it. It was a reminder to say happy birthday to you guys. But, um, yeah, my water signs are Pisces, Cancers, and Scorpios. So, I do feel like for this, oh, I just noticed three major cards out of four cards. So, major changes for a lot of you for this weekend. I do feel like a lot of you, like your love um, relationships are really what you are most focusing about. Which is funny because the first card that I picked up is the lover's card. And I kept thinking air sign, air sign, air sign. And the lover's card is a representation for the sign of Gemini. And Gemini is an air sign which is right beside the sign of Cancer. So Cancers, you may have some Gemini within you or there may be something going on within the planets that may cause Gemini to be involved in something. I don't know. But Gemini is a very yin-yang, wishy-washy kind of sign. So some of you, like, you may feel kind of wishy-washy for this weekend. Or um, this may be a very good time for you guys to try and find a balance within certain situations, whether it's trying to find a balance within your emotional and your logic thinking, um, submissive or dominance, like, whatever this may be, just try and find a balance. But, um, like I say, a lot of you, like, you're kind of emphasizing on your love relationship for this weekend. And, um, you are going to have to, you, you are going to have to make some choices and decisions involving things that you are very passionate about and things that you really want to manifest, all right? So, do what you need to do. A lot of you, like, you may still be holding on to some sort of past baggage. Or you may hold on to, uh, your money. Like, you're just going to be greedy. Don't do that. Please don't do that. Um, yeah, especially like if you, uh, are celebrating your birthday this weekend and you know you have a bill coming up, you may be like, um, it's my birthday, my bill can wait. So you may kind of hold, you know, your finances on that one. But honestly, I do feel like some of you, like within your relationships, you are still, you and the other person are still holding on to some sort of past baggage and you may, um compare your relationships to your past relationship so be careful about that like please don't do that it's just not worth it like this is something new um like this is a new person who you want to share a new beginning with so don't allow the past to you know control whatever it is going on within your life which is funny because my girlfriends say this to me all the time she does and i do feel like she may be going through the same thing but um also, some of you, like, you kind of may be tied into an, uh, an Aquarius, or you may encounter an Aquarius person who may help you in some sort, some way, whether it's good or bad, honestly, depends upon the relationship that you have with this um, Aquarius person. This may be friendship or a love partner as well. But um, some of you, like, you do need to cleanse away, like, past thoughts or the past you, because, like, I do feel like you, boy, like, um... The person who you want to be is really not meshing with the person who you are now. So you, there may be some sort of bad habits or some sort of past issues that you need to let go of in order to establish or break through in order to achieve the person who you want to be. So please do that. You need to go through some sort of cleansing and, connect, and connecting with your higher power. So if you can, please do some meditation. That will really help you guys out a lot. And just relaxing. If you can, look out into the stars and pray upon the stars and ask them for guidance. And you will have some very powerful dreams involving water. You are water sign, so get in tune with your water element for this weekend, all right? But I do feel there's going to be some sort of breakthrough. I do feel like there may be some sort of breakthrough um, Sunday or Monday. Um, and... Some of you, like, you may fall into tears because you may feel kind of happy about something. Or you just may be, like, really giggly and happy. But um, I do feel like you have to take that extra leap of faith and believe in the unknown and trust the universe. Because there's going to be some sort of opportunity that the universe is going to hand you. And you have to open it. You have to accept it with open arms and open to it, for real. But um, on the other hand, like, some of you, like, don't be so starry-eyed. And if you've been wishing, like, so much, 
the universe may be trying to tell you guys that you need to take action toward the things that you want. Like, this is tying into me to what I just said. If you want to become something, but you know the present you has to change, the universe wants you to stop wishing for, oh, I want this, I want that, but you know that you need to change. So actions speak louder than words. The universe wants you to show them that you can change in order to um, receive what it is you need to receive to be the person who you want to become, all right? Um, this is also like tying into, like, don't be so starry eyed, don't be so naive and close minded to certain situations. Be open to change. It's really all I'm picking up is just be open to change for this weekend, for real. But the message for my um, Pisces out there, hmm, move away from certain situations that's no longer benefiting you. Yes, um, this is also tying into make room for change. A lot of you, like you may be experiencing um, backing away from a certain situation or relationship or job or possibly moving. This is gonna hurt you um, emotionally. But you know that you need to make room for change. In order for you to get what you want, you have to back away from something. And once you back away and close that door, another one will open, all right? But the message for my counselors out there, this is all about change, for real. This weekend is all about change. But um, it's time for you guys to gain a new mindset to certain situations, especially involving, um, like, to try and solve problems. Especially like if you've been accounting the same ongoing problem forever. It's time to gain a new mindset in order to fight your battles. Alright? We are the pros and the cons. Think logically. This is a very good card for um, willpower. And um, to grab new opportunities mentally. This is, all, this is a very good time for you guys to stop being so emotional. And think logically. Alright? Yes. I... I just now thought about this. You guys are water sign and you're very emotional. And Geminis are like an air sign on, on this all about the logic thinking. So maybe have a little bit of Gemini in you for this weekend, all right? And uh, trying to find a balance within your emotional self and your logic thinking self. So please do that. But my Scorpios. So some of you, like, you you may lose interest within something or you just may feel like giving up on something. You, this, is, this is a very good time for you to surrender to something. Maybe surrender to the things that you've been wishing for. Surrender to the person who you are still... Okay, how am I trying to say this? Some of you, like, you are still... You're still stuck in the past, so it's a very good time for you guys to surrender to your past to your past self in order for you to be who you are meant to be within your present. Also, some of some people may um try and offer you advice, but you you just don't want to take it. You really really don't. This is also a very good time for you guys to meditate. This is a card representation for meta for um, meditation as well. Some of you like you may meditate via um spirituality or through marijuana so very interesting but honestly the universe is is offering you something or people are offering you something and you're just like i don't know i really don't want it you're kind of being close-minded to change don't do that please don't do that honestly this weekend is all about change so open your arms out to change for real all right let's try to have a good weekend my water signs and happy birthday my cancers this is corny but whatever and i will see you guys next weekend Bye.